Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and if you are on version 2004, 20H2 and 21H1, whatever version you are, there has been a bug fixing update that was released uh, late yesterday and uh, that means that today, Tuesday, uh, June 22nd, 2021, you should have that available. It installed on my PC in a pretty quick way. Uh, took less than, overall, took less than maybe five or ten minutes. The um, update, which is um, uh, available for the latest versions of Windows 10, all three supported versions, basically. Um, if you go to Update and Security, check for updates, you should see that arrive. Uh, in my case, I have received it uh, as update and other updates here. Cumulative update 5003690 uh, for my computer. And uh, it, of course, is a bug fixing update, and there's a lot of bugs that are fixed in here. There's also gaming performance improvements. So some people were complaining of gaming performance problems in some of the latest updates. Um, and so this one, one of the things that it does is actually improve the gaming performance. For the rest, it uh, has, um, so it's, when just to say that when KB5000842 was installed, some people complained of gaming performance issues. So this fixes that, by the way. Uh, for the rest, there's a really a big list of bug fixes. Um, what I say here, this there's absolutely no security updates in this thing. So what I have to say here is if you have um, no problems, no issues, you don't have to install it. This is an optional download and install. It doesn't install automatically. And uh, once you installed it, what you should have when you go to the Windows version command, WinVer, you should be at either 19041, 19042, or 19043.1081. So the ending is the same for all three versions since they share the same core, but uh, the build number 19041, 19042, or 19043 is the, uh, the, uh, the build numbers that are um, actually updated here. And the ending is at 1081. Bug fixing updates once again, nothing really uh, security. So if you have no problems, you can stay away from this. It installs automatically anyways when you get Patch Tuesday, but uh, if you don't need, if you don't have any problems, you don't need it. Just leave it alone. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.